Good evening everyone. Welcome to BISP Solutions. This is Farha Alam and today we are going to see another important feature that falls in OTBI reporting tool that is drill down functionality. So let's get started and see what does, does this drill down functionality do in OTBI reporting tool. So the drill down feature enables you to research beyond the summary information. And next we have drill down is a capability that takes the user from a more general view of the data to a more specific one. It means that uh, uh, under this uh, drill down uh, feature, what we will do basically, we will going to create uh, two views. One will going to contain the summary view basically the brief uh, view of uh, any uh, analysis or information and then we will going to create uh, another view which contains uh, the detailed information for that uh, particular analysis and uh, we will going to establish uh, the link between them and we will uh, switch or navigate from the summary view to the detailed view so this is basically uh, the functionality of drill down under OTBI reporting tool. So let's get started and we will see how do we implement in our, uh, how do we implement this drill down uh, feature in our OTBI reports. So first we will see the requirement regarding this uh, drill down functionality. So this drill down, uh, the requirement for this drill down functionality is we are going to create uh, the <coughs> summary view, which will going to contain uh, these uh, three basic information for an employee or worker. Uh, so it contains the summary view will going to contain the system person type, assignment category and head count and our subject area will be workforce management worker assignment real time and we'll going to create the detailed view which will going to contain the uh, person number name manager information business unit information job information department worker legislation location position and all these information what um, uh, detailed view will going to contain these information so and what we will do, we will going to navigate from this summary analysis to the detailed one. And what kind of output we will get from this one. So this is basically the output. This is the summary view, which contains um, basically three uh, measures, system person type, assignment category and headcount. And whenever um, here uh, we will implement the drill down functionality for the headcount and whenever we click on any of the headcount it will redirect us to the detailed view for that particular headcount so this is basically the detailed view and this is the output of the analysis uh, so let's get started and see how do we do that just go to the bi catalog this is the bi catalog and these are the previously created analysis so for in order to create a new one we just going to click on create option and click on this first one which is analysis so when we so when we click on the create option and analysis option one subject area will get open then we will select our respective subject area which is workforce management work assignment real time this one click on it and then we will select the respective measures So these are the measures from for the, the summary view, uh, system person type, assignment category and headcount. Just click on the results tab to get the preview for this one. And this is the one. This is the output for this one. 
this is the output for our summary view just save it provide the name click on ok next we are going to create another new analysis which contains the detailed information same subject area i am going to select workforce management worker assignment real time so these are the measures which i had selected from uh, from workforce management worker assignment real time for detailed view click on the results tab to get the preview for this one so here we get the detailed view for this one click on this uh, table properties option and click on content paging so that you will not be able to horizontally scroll the analysis in order to get the information just save it provide the name and click on ok so here we had created two analysis right so now what next we will do we will just going to enable the drill down functionality so we will just go back to our summary view which one is our summary view basically click uh, employee head count summary view click it on uh, open it in the edit mode and uh, just go back to the criteria tab and uh, click on the setting icon and click for head count click on column properties and from uh, under this column properties we just have to click on the interaction tab and here just click on this uh, primary interaction and click on action link and here we have to provide the link on which we are going to redirect ourselves click on this add action link and provide the link text over here so we will going to see the view detail head count this is the link text which will be visible to the which will be visible for the head counts when we uh over the head count click on this uh, create new action and uh, just select third one navigate to bi content as we are going to navigate from one bi content to another which is the summary head count view to the detailed head count and provide the appropriate location for that one and this is my detailed view click on this one select it click on ok and here uh, just click on the options button and enable this open in new window so what will happen when we uh, enable this option whenever we click on any of the head count it will uh, open the detailed view for the analysis in a new tab click on ok 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 one more okay and then save it just go back to the catalog and run the analysis open it 
so here we can see the drill down functionality has been enabled for the head count so when i click on any of them it will display the text which i had provided view detailed head count so i am going to get the detailed view for the system person type is contingent worker and assignment category is full time regular so that we will going to navigate for the detailed view for this particular head count information so this is the detailed view for the those head counts and if i click on another one like uh, if i click on this one uh, the system person type is employee and assignment category is full time head count is 93 when i click on this one it will display the link text and when i click on it it will redirect me to the detailed view for this particular head counts so this is about uh, the drill down functionality in hcm cloud otbi reports and all about our today's session and we'll continue in our upcoming session thank you everyone for watching